far east tip of this map, marked in red, is a serene space that students have been cultivating since 1977. Located behind North Campus, the Humber Arboretum was created in response to School of Applied Technology landscape students' desire to engage in experiential learning. Spanning 250 acres, the present-day Arboretum includes botanical gardens, trails, ponds, and outdoor learning spaces. Since its inception, students have designed and created many beautiful features within it, most notably the Garden of the Rising Moon. With a waterfall and beautiful surrounding gardens, it is not only a student showcase, it's a lasting legacy. In 1993, a partnership was created between the Canadian Plastics Industry Association and Humber College to provide a plastics manufacturing centre. Over the next 15 years, more than 500 students would graduate and more than 1,000 employees would receive training in this centre. This experience would be revered over a quarter of a century later when Humber opens its new Center for Technology Innovation in 2017. One of many memorable moments in the School of Applied Technology's rich history in groundbreaking initiatives and competition. Operation First Contact was a technological feat that allowed students to make contact with the International Space Station, something that their teachers called a first. Applying knowledge from their radio communications courses, students sent up their signal and after a crackle of static, the voice of astronaut Sandra Magnus filled the room for a full 10 minutes, answering questions from a very excited group of students. This moment of triumph was celebrated by the entire college. Students in the technology programs have always had much to celebrate. A series of highly specialized labs, along with experienced faculty, create the perfect formula for success in skills competitions. The Humber Center for Trades and Technology is a 95,000 square foot training center that wraps around two framed townhomes. Students use these simulated work sites to practice skills for their careers and for the Skills Canada National Competition. Every year, more than 500 people participate in over 40 skilled trade and technology events. In 2016, two Humber students won gold in mechatronics, the category Humber has dominated since 2004, winning gold six times, silver three times, and bronze once. On the flip side of technology is the school's design programs. To support the launch of its new degree programs, the School of Applied Technology created the Design Center in 2012. The 88,000 square foot open concept layout mirrors the working environments of professional design and architectural firms. This initiative was a proclamation of the school, taking a leadership role in design education and training. A lot of ground has been covered by the School of Applied Technology in the past 50 years, with more innovation on the horizon. Happy 50th anniversary, Humber.